hey this is leslie um i have a quick word for you um i'm driving again and a song fell in my spirit um it's a kirk franklin song and it's called he'll take the pain away and i immediately um you know, uh, I hadn't heard this, I haven't heard the song in a long time, so I kind of started singing to myself, and I was like, oh, I wonder who this is for, because I'm not in pain. So, uh, <laughs> so I go on YouTube, and I look for the song so that I could play the song. Immediately start crying as the song starts. I said, oh, girl, I guess this song was for you. Um, I don't know who needs to hear this or who this is for as well, because I know it's not just myself. But there is no pain that is so great that God cannot heal. The thing about it is we are really already healed. I know that um, healing can be a process and right now we're walking it out. But God, Jesus Christ, on this good Friday, right? <laughs> on this good Friday, this is what he died for. He died for our pain. He died for our suffering. He died so that we wouldn't have to be miserable, so that we wouldn't have to be depressed, so that we wouldn't have to be ashamed, sad, embarrassed. None of those things. None of those things are supposed to be our portion, okay? This is what Jesus died for. He took all the pain. There is nothing that we have gone through that he has not experienced, that he does not feel and understand. He, the song says he'll take the pain away. He has taken the pain away. I know you may not feel like it at this moment. I know that, um, as I said, it's a process and each day is going to get better. And then some days you're going to feel like you're being knocked back 10 steps, depending on what happens. But understand that he will take the pain away. He already has taken the pain away. He died so that you wouldn't have to live in this pain. You are not built for this type of pain. Some of you are experiencing other karabatoyaseya otherworldly type of pain the enemy has put a type of pain on you and a, a type of shame on you and a type of embarrassment on you that he wants to cause you to literally take yourself up out of here it's so heavy it's such a burden it's such a heavy weight and god says this i say i died my son died so that you wouldn't have to live under this type of oppression this type of yoke this type of bondage this is not your portion your mortal body can't even handle this stuff do you understand that is why jesus when he took on all of our pain all of our sorrow all of our afflictions all of our sin that's why he began to to to, to sweat drops of blood yes the mission was great but the weight of the sin of the world the weight of the sins of the world was so great and it was hey, am I so and am I see it? it was upon his back it was oh my god the chastisement of our peace oh my god Jesus died do you understand he died so that we wouldn't have to feel any of this so that we wouldn't have to experience this and he knew things would still come up against us different trials and tribulations but he took this on thousands of years ago so that we would have peace eternal peace we would have eternal life with him that we would see that there is a way through these things all these situations that we face there is nothing that you can't get through with jesus as your savior the song says if any man be in jesus he'll take the pain away you gotta be in christ he can't take what you won't give him you gotta lay this thing at his feet lay it at the altar give it to him give it to him because he's already died for it his death was not in vain his burial and his resurrection hallelujah none of it was in vain give it over to him and he will take the pain away there is nothing that our father that um, our brother jesus you know our, our joint joint heirs there's nothing that our savior will not do for us oh my goodness do y'all understand he died so that we would not have to live in this afflicted state so that we would so that depression would not be our portion so many of us myself included have struggled with depression for years have struggled with 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 even with suicidal thoughts behind different situations and different people and things that have happened and god is saying no none of that none of that is your portion none of that is something that you're supposed to be going through i know things are going to come up against you but you got to get deeply rooted in me you got to dwell in me you got to see that there's so much for it there's greater for you on the other side of this thing i understand what the enemy is trying to do i understand how he's trying to come up against you i understand how he's trying to take you out but child of god i have given you strategy i have given you the i have given you my holy spirit i have given you the gift of prayer and you and my son intercedes for you on a daily minute by minute basis child of god you will not succumb to this thing i don't care what the enemy says i don't care what it looks like god has got you he will take the pain away give it to him set it at his feet set it before him he'll take the pain away the pain is already gone we need to start looking at this thing in the past 
past tense. It's gone. It's already done. It's already, and if I see and I hear the word eradicated, it's gone. It's already been done. Start looking at this thing with a fresh set of eyes. Renew your mind daily. This is why we, this is why his mercy, this is why his mercies are, are, are renewed daily. This is why they are new every single day. Grace upon grace upon grace, mercy upon mercy upon mercy. He's refreshing you every time you open up your eyes in the morning. You've got new mercies. He will take the pain away. He will take the pain away. If you are in Christ Jesus, he will take the pain away. That pain cannot stay there for forever, beloved. It can't haunt you for forever. Your past can't haunt you for forever. What they did to you can't haunt you. What they said to you, what about what you did to yourself, the type of life you live, he's going to take all the pain away. He's going to make it so you don't even look like what you've been through. All that fire, all that smoke, you don't, you don't smell like it. You don't look like it. You ain't burnt up. God's going to take all of that away. In the name of Jesus. Y'all, that song was for me. Woo! <laughs> if it was for you, let me know. He'll take the pain away. Have a blessed day.